and Thomas Blue here back for another video and today we're going to be taking a look at the Young Bao the Hero Trackmaster 2 pack. <clears throat> so I actually have him in Thomas Wood and I've reviewed him in Thomas Wood and he will be compared to his Thomas Wood version here but um you guys haven't seen that review because I haven't finished editing it yet so that review for Thomas Wood should be up in a while. Not a while you know give it a week or two or three. Uh, yeah that's going to take a while, I guess, because I uploaded them in order, and these are getting edited today to go up today, June 10th. So anyway, um, it's Young Bao the Hero, based on Big World, Big Adventure pack. It's, um, pull out and toe in the real line. Here he is in here. He doesn't look too bad. So, I don't mind Young Bao. He's not my favorite character, but... You know, whatever. Um, they had him in the store. They didn't have Nia. Uh, Big World of the Adventures. Young Brother Hero said on the side. The back says, Big World. In the movie Big World, Big Adventures, Thomas journeys around the globe. And when he needs help in China, Young Bao races to the rescue. For more ways to play, Young Bao includes a towing winch with a tow line that can be pulled out and reeled in. So, fun times for all, I suppose. Young Bao on the side, Legal Guff on the bottom, and Grab the Hero on the top. Remember, kitties, be careful with the rays, they're sharp. Close the razor for safety, and we'll open this up. Pull him out, push the box to the side. Um, okay, let's look at Young Bao first. Here he is. He doesn't look terrible. Actually, he looks pretty good. You got a lot of detailing on the front. Got a large cow catcher. Um, I don't like how his dragon on top is not painted. I mean, that couldn't have been too hard to do. That's a very defining feature. I may have to get a yellow marker just to go ahead and do that. Um, he does look nice on the side with his detailing like this. I mean, his... Wheelbase is too generalized for my liking, but all the detailing, like the side rod, the, I mean, the whistles and the valves are actually molded, like, raised up on three feeling. Um, you got a tender with the cogged wheels. Very basic looking tender, but, you know, it looks alright. Um, unpainted buffers on the front, though, like, unpainted dragon as well. Nothing on the back. Oh, they got a tail lamp back there. Quite a nice detailed model though, I have to admit, with the small valves and whatnot. Why is the show going down when the toys are going up again? Oh, it's very reminiscent of Miller ever. Um she's got this tow cable thing on this wagon that's green. Um, if you release it with this, it is able to unattach, or at least it should be. Um, hmm. There we go. That was too hard. Not a very long tow cable. Um, it feels very flimsy, like... This feels like I could snap this if I tried, which I don't want to. The plastic on this cart actually feels kind of like a knockoff cart, really. It feels weak. Um, this cart feels very cheap. Like, they went for the engine on this one, and they skimped on the free car. I mean, I'll winch it back in. Even this is tough, especially for my big hands. So I'm not a big fan of that. Um... Put the batteries in Young Bao over here. Um, okay. Slip that on. 
like, I'm reviewing these and uploading these today, like, while the Thomas Wood review for Young Bear was not out. Because, um... Because... When I think, but like, I didn't review Lexi. I got Trackmaster Lexi yet last year. I don't really collect the Trackmaster too much. But it was a good model, but I didn't get to review her before, like, the whole wave came out, so... I'm reviewing these well, as soon as I get them. So he runs, um, we'll tough out, we'll run him in a second. But, um... We'll just really get his wood model over here for a minute. And we can just talk about how much better this is than this. Because, like, look here. I mean, his smoke... He doesn't have his cow catcher. That's the one. That's problem one. His smoke deflectors are red on the inside, as, long as, as well as his smoke box. And on top, his dragon doesn't even exist. It's just kind of there. There's a practically no detailing. I mean, it's, you know, it's wood detailing. Yeah. The wood young guy was terrible. That's, that's summing up my review right there. You'll see the review eventually. His tender as well was very generalized. Though I feel like his tender was definitely better than the engine on the wood model. But then again, how hard is it to mess up a tender? But, um, yeah. We'll come back to him another time on my channel. Or should I say we'll start with him. Also, would like to quickly pull in his Asia counterpart of Hero. I actually have the Hit Toy version. That was the one I got when it first came out, the Hit Toy version. I got it in Florida. Um, while I was on vacation, actually. But um, I don't think the Trackmaster 2 model looks too bad. I got it when it was on sale at Toys Us because it was the last one on the closing sale. Um, I like Hero better, to be honest. Not in terms of detailing and whatnot. I mean, like, as a character, just because I like Japanese trains, and Hero is quite literally a, a famous Japanese train, just, you know, without a face. Or with a face. But, um, I like that about Hero, but that's kind of biased. But, let's put him on it. Uh, detail his buffers in the front real quick. And, um... I'd be right. Well, I mean, you know, his buffers are so small I could do them right here, I guess. What tell should really do this, not me. Um, there it is. It's not great, it's just kind of quickly done with my dried up marker. But, um, I should also mention, these are $15 at Target. For uh, the, the last two or three waves, they were, um, only 10 and they've raised it up to 15, which is unfortunate. But I almost give them a run. And so we'll divert him into the siding here. And he's crashed. Okay. So, obviously, he's not a bad model. Uh, I do really actually think he's well detailed, even if he's not my favorite character. I mean, he's even got molded piston rod detail. Uh, piston, I think this is. Um, detailing. So, you know what? I think he's a quite good model for what he is, even if. He's not my number one character. But, um, I definitely like him. And I think, you know, I look forward to getting Nia as well. Even if she's not too great either. But, well, you know, we'll wait till we get her. But, um, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye, everyone.